Nothing else, I'm going to rip the packaging out. Cover this, but if you do. Here we... Oh, here we are. It is 7.01 in the morning. I had to get up at 5.30 this morning. Ungodly hour on a Saturday. To head to my event today, I have a full day. Um, I didn't get to bed till 12, 12.30, because I did retwist my hair. Um, I am on time thus far, praise God. So, I got my coffee. Um, I'm getting ready to pull out my breakfast that I'll probably eat once we get down the road some. Get my podcast going, and we're going to get on down the road to start this day. Um, welcome to a new vlog. Sorry I didn't say that before. Um, if you're new here, hey, y'all. Uh, we get lots of new subbies, and I love that for us. Um, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe um, in case I don't say that at the end. Uh, but welcome, welcome, welcome. This is the first day of a new vlog. Um, it's definitely giving a day, a week in my life because I'm always busy. Um, but let's go ahead and get on down the road and we'll see what today holds for us. A few moments later. Good morning, you guys. <laughs> Y'all know me. Y'all ain't getting no footage yesterday. Show did. Um, it was a very long day. Um, I was really very much in the moment. And I'm actually big mad because I didn't take any pictures. And my cute blazer that I was talking about, y'all, That I got lots of compliments, compliments, though. Like, I ended up wearing the blazer with some yellow pants and a yellow top. And I wore my blue heels. I was giving it to the people. Today is Founders Day. I would eat, but the way that my throat is raspy. But shout out to Mary Lou and the crew and the founders for founding the best and baddest sorority around. Okay, all right. We was founded on November twelfth, nineteen twenty-two. Okay, in Indiana, Indianapolis. Okay, back where there was segregation and uh, the Ku Klux Klan. But I ain't gonna give y'all no history lesson right now. Y'all didn't cover this, but if you do, anyways. Um, so what's about to happen is finally, y'all, my body was so tired. Yeah, if y'all y'all know, last vlog I've been on the move. Um, didn't go to bed till late on Friday evening. Um, got up at five thirty in the morning just to get to be ready for events at eight thirty, and I was on the move. Not all so much like busy, 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 busy. But when I get around my sores, y'all like especially my chapter sores. Like, I love them so much. Like, when I get around them, it's literally like, you ever, like, go, like, when you go to your family reunions or your favorite cousin or somebody, and when you see them, like, nothing else matters. You ain't thinking about your phone. You ain't thinking about nothing. You just enjoy the moment, especially when you don't get to see them as often as you like. And so every time I'm with them, like, I feel like time doesn't matter. I forget about time, all of that. Like, it's a beautiful thing. And not everybody has that and that. I hate that for them, but I am really thankful that I have it because it's a beautiful thing. Like, every time I'm around, typically my sons and every time I'm around people that I genuinely love and care about, like, when I'm around them, like, what is time? Like, I could be with them for a long time, all night, all day, if you want it, because I really enjoy your company, and I'm really thankful for that. So, got home about, I think it was like 10 o'clock probably, like 9.30. I think I pulled up about 9.45. By the time I got in the house, it was 10 o'clock. I came in, took me a shower or whatever, and then I talked to my other sore while she was driving home. And then, baby, I felt bad because I feel like, like Friday I was really busy because I had to work and Daniel wasn't in school. So I really feel like I haven't seen my family in like two days. Like, it's been in passing. I know my eye look bad. I put on eyeliner. And I'm guessing it must be waterproof because I washed my makeup off, but it's giving a raccoon. And so it's not adding to the fact that I'm really tired because it's like, I know like, dang, yeah, you tired, ain't you? But also, yes. Um, <laughs> it's in my voice. I ain't sick. I'm tired. So um, I felt really bad. I hadn't seen my baby. Neither one of them, really. Um, but he had to work early this morning, so hopefully I'm going to rest him. And he's going to be tired, too. But we can spend some time together because I've been on the move. But, yeah, so I decided I was really hungry, and I didn't want to cook. Sure didn't. Um, so I decided I want to go out to breakfast for Founders Day. 
Um, and that's what we're about to do. So I'm about to, I've already taken my shower. I'm about to iron my clothes. Um, I'm not about to beat my face or nothing because I can't. I'm real tired. I am going to put some, I'm going to do, put the, uh, what is it, the brow gel on my eyebrows and probably put some mascara, maybe and some gloss and shine my face and put some SPF on and call it a day because I can't. I'm real tired. Um, I'm going to get some good food in my belly and probably I'm hoping to catch up on some shows and watch some TV and really relax. It's going to be a really chill Founders Day for me because since I'm tired. Um, but um, I can't, also can't promise that I won't be napping most of the day. Um, luckily this week I do work, in, work from home um, so I don't have to get up as early. Um, really. Let's call it spade to spade. When you work from home, we know you get right out of bed, use the bathroom, brush your teeth, wash your face, and go over to your workstation. Don't nobody be really taking showers and getting dressed for real. Come up, comment down below if you work from home what you do. I know what I do. My lunch be a shower. Anyways, so yeah, so I'm grateful for that. So I'm really gonna take this week to really rest. Um on this week's docket, we do have some events uh, to take place. Daniel has a field trip on Tuesday. I was trying to chaperone or whatever, but I ain't heard back from the teacher. But honestly, if I was her and knowing that the parent don't really like me for real, I wouldn't comment either. But since this ain't about you, this is about being here with my son. But, I mean, whatever. Um, he has that, and then he has a doctor appointment on Friday. I'm just going to go ahead and take him out uh, for the rest of the day because actually... Got his report card, and honestly, after seeing, going to the open house and seeing the chaos that is real life in the classroom, um, it's giving, y'all remember when y'all was in college, and you had the professor that really couldn't teach good for real, and you had to teach yourself at one of the past, it's that, so it's giving, I'm about to be, like, also part-time teacher. But that's fine. I have accepted mission, and we gon' we are going up for that. He was really upset um about how, what his grades were like. But I said no, it's fine. It's your first one, um and I I know the chaos that y'all have going on in that classroom, and what it says is that we got things to do, and that's okay. I haven't been talking for six minutes, and I'm gonna be real mad about this um later. So anyways, um that's that. We have um. Well, by the time this come out, they would have already been out anyway. So, um, my undergraduate sores, um, I have that program on Friday, so I'm going to attend that. Um, I need to take out my jacket that you remember I got for, um, my anniversary that they bought me. I need to get that out and get that stain to get them wrinkles out of that, because that's what I want to wear Friday. And then I'm about to be in retirement until the December party um, on the 16th, which is next month, I'm so. It's a busy season, but it's content. So, anyways, I'm about to get dressed, and the next time that you, I'll pick up this camera, will probably be at breakfast. Hi, it's here. They're not going to. I don't know why I'm talking because you probably can hear the music. Just enjoy the daytime view of the ice cream. Anyway. Take two. Welcome back to my channel, you guys. So, I got my boxy charm in Friday. Been rocking and rolling. Haven't really been able to unbox it. So, let's do that. Now, I was hoping that I could have done this and my Ipsy together, but child Ipsy, I don't know. Anyways, so the first thing we have is this duo brush. It's duo brush, which is it's the 242 brush. It's by Phil. So it has like the sponge or 
or beauty blender side here where you can kind of get up under the eye things of that sort and really get that and then you have the kind of where you can um put in your like powder so you know when you're like we'll we'll we'll, we'll do a little short on how to do it but you would essentially use this to kind of pat it in and then when you go in with your powder you would go in and kind of dust that off so this is really clutch um a duo brush we'll definitely try that out not this week make well maybe friday um because that'll be the next time i'll do my makeup um for the probate so we might try that out um next we have girl 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 act whatever it's a lash play duo mascara um and i really think i just i'm always ripping a box okay i don't do nothing else i'm gonna rip the packaging child okay so this is what the packaging is looking like so on this end you oh look you have the mascara and then on this end what's the difference is another one so you got oh this might be for your bottom lashes okay so i'm guessing one is for the top like right under, underneath here and that smaller one is to help you get your bottom lashes most likely because i'm pretty sure boxy charm didn't tell me what to do with my items of course not nope of course not so that's my guessing on what to do with it do i know that for a fact no <laughs> Does it say how to apply? Okay. Apply the lengthening side to your upper lashes for definition and use the detail side on your lower lashes. Oh, look at me. I do know a little something, Donna. Don't play with me. Okay. Also, my energy is though, y'all still recouping from Saturday. Still real tired. So bear with me. Hopefully, I will get my energy back back up soon. So next, we have the Cora Life Vitamin C Lip Treatment, which is needed, child, because baby, my lips has been feeling a little chat. So this is what the packaging is looking like. And does it have a smell? What is it doing? Okay, I don't smell anything. Do we have directions on how to use this? All right, unscrew the cap and apply on a thin, even coat of lip treatment to clean lips. Rub lips together to even out product. Well, clean lips. You mean, you must mean after I wash my face? So, okay. I'm guessing you shouldn't put this on when you got something on them already. So, this wouldn't be your touch-up. This would probably be your first thing. Um... Probably a good prep before you do your makeup type stuff. Yeah. Next we have the Undergrade Brows Pencil and Gel Duo. They gave us a lot of duos and this is in medium brown. I have been using the pencil lately. Um, which I forgot how like bomb your like eyebrows be when you do that. But also, fun fact, when you switch in between different mediums meaning pencil <laughs> meaning um pencil brow gel um the mechanical brush type not brush mechanical pencil all of them when you go back and forth between the first couple of times when you go back to it you kind of forget your mojo or whatever so that's why i do like to switch in between mediums so that i always know how to do my brows no matter what i'm using because depending on the product i want to try depends on if i'll just stick with the pencil pencils do your eyebrows really good but i hate that you literally have to sharpen your pencil every day or every two days if you do your makeup every day that's the only thing I hate. Mechanical pencils, they last pretty good, and you just keep, you know, winding them up. So, anywho, so on this side, oh, this is to brush your. I love, like, is this, oh, Lord, God, that's a brow gel. And you're just going to pile that right up there. So, clearly, that was a brow gel that I just showed you. So, this is what it looks like. Some of the gel is in here. So, and I already got some brow gel, but I'm going to lay this right here because it already comes together. Because sometimes I'd be forgetting. And then this is 
the pencil. Oh, and it's slanted too, y'all. Okay. Now, like I said, I've been using the pencil. So when I first use this, my brows ain't going to be hitting like I want them at first. And that's okay. You give yourself grace and you remember how to use it. But yeah. Last but not least is a eyeshadow palette. And again, y'all always know I'm always going to rip up a package. Period. I really need to, probably during the holiday season, because generally, if we call it a book, that's when I generally like declutter and purge my things. So we're definitely going to start with the first purging would be over there in that beauty section, because I know I have a lot of um, makeup palettes and things of that sort that are very much old and very much expired. And if you didn't know, makeup expires. If your skin is itching or burning, let it go because the product you're using should never be itching. Also, with, with eyeshadow, if the color ain't coloring, it's more than likely expired. Most times, if you ever wonder, pro tip, let me go. Right here, if you look on the back, all makeup products, even skin products and some hair products, maybe even perfume, but don't quote me on that, has this little like circle thing. Girl, get over here. And y'all probably can't see that. But take a look at your stuff. And it'll tell you how long you have on the product. So eyeshadows, you have a year. I'm going to keep it a buck. On my eyeshadows, I'm definitely going to keep it longer than a year. For my eyeshadows, <laughs> now on a client, I would use my most recent and brand new and in date eyeshadow. But as for me and, me and mine, I'm going to use it. Most likely until it itches <laughs> or, or the color ain't coloring. But I ain't throwing my eyeshadows away in a year. I'm just not doing it. Um, but foundation, most foundation uh, is a year. You might get two years, but it's a year. Concealer is six months, baby. Use a concealer. So if y'all been wondering why, girl, you ain't going the way you beating your face. Because y'all remember when I found out that when I found out last year. That makeup expired, that's why. So I'm going to beat my face because one thing's for sure. I used to be like, oh, I don't want to beat my face because I don't want to be wasting my products. But baby, you're still wasting it if it expires. So do your makeup. Okay, so. Oh, I like how this open. Look at this, y'all. Phew. Well, these colors is pretty. What, why this don't open? What's, what's this doing? What's happening? I don't understand. Does it? The, oh, I didn't see what I'm saying. I can't have nothing last. Maybe that ain't supposed to have happened. So I'm gonna tie it opens. Um, and these these colors are really pretty. Omg. So y'all know I don't swatch well. So I'm gonna swatch them on my arm, and then I'm gonna put them beside here. But these pretty these colors are really really pretty. I'm definitely liking this this one right here. I like this teal, these two right here. That black is black and honey. I like this gold and this right here. So, um, I don't care what y'all say, but I'm going back to doing, we're going we gonna to try out products. And obviously, I'm going to try and do makeup looks that use the most, the most colors in one look. But looking at it, it's probably giving at least three makeup looks. So, there are going to be three makeup looks with this. I don't know. I'm not sure if I'm going to do them in a full sit-down makeup or whatever. Or if I'm going to do it in a short. It might be a short. Might be a short or a reel on Instagram. I'm trying to, I'm trying, I'm trying to be diverse and go places. But I'm going to let y'all know that I'm bringing, I'm bringing things back. I'm going to do the first initial look inside of a vlog type situation because y'all really don't like it by itself um but after that the other two will be in a short so you could because i feel like to do it justice i have to do it inside a vlog or in a get ready with me so y'all really know how it goes because you know in the short it going it's going really quick but in order for y'all to know my real thoughts we got to do it together so I might as well get it ready with me. But I'm excited about that. But that's all I've got in the boxy charm on today's dockets. I'm tired. I ain't even gonna lie to you. Um, my house is doing a whole lot. Not really. It's y'all know I normally clean on the weekends because it's it's just been really helpful for me because when I'm super busy, 
when my house is clean, I'm not as stressed. So my weekend was super busy and I wasn't able to clean. And my husband cleaned whenever the spirit leads him. The spirit did not lead lead. Oh, I was about to say what's happening. The spirit did not leave lead my husband this weekend. He claims it's gonna lead him Tuesday. So, with that being said, unfortunately, I'm gonna have to clean during the week because we have Christmas parade coming up, and I'm gonna be honest with y'all, y'all not gonna see the Christmas parade till Vlogmas, day one of Vlogmas, because I'm I'm done minding y'all. I prep for Vlogmas starting the last two weeks of uh, uh, November. And honestly, depending on my content and how it comes out, <laughs> y'all know I always got back no content. But I've been in date lately. But I think I still have a backed up one. You always got to keep a backed up footage so you can drop it when you take a break. But I am going to take the last week of November as a break, but you guys won't notice, so that I can get, at, so I can be at least, at the very least, five videos in by the time day one of vlogmas starts for real for real so y'all know most of the time that vlogmas doesn't start to be in real time till like towards the end of vlogmas and i have to be creative because y'all know we got things going on the last day um and i probably won't be able to edit it so i'm trying to figure out if i'm going to i don't know what i'm gonna do but i have to somehow end it and then yeah, anyways, I'll figure it out. I'm still trying to figure it out. But I'm going to take a break, but you guys won't notice because honestly, it's already, we're already, this is the week of the 18th. And so I have a video, I have the vlog from last week that's going to come out this week. And this vlog we're talking on now is going to be like Thanksgiving week. And so technically, you guys won't even notice um, that there was a break, so to speak, because I think I would use that emergency, that emergency um, one. And drop that last week, and then we're going right into Vlogmas. Or you might not get a video that week, and we go into Vlogmas. Probably. Most likely, this part, the first video will probably be Vlogmas. Anywho, I say all that to say, what am I saying? Oh, um, so I have to clean. My mom's coming into town, and my sister, and my nieces, and nephews, and so I need to clean my house. So today... I, the laundry from last week didn't get finished. I need to follow those two baskets, wash the last two loads, more than likely wash my son's clothes because who's to say he'll probably wake up tomorrow for school and don't have no underwear and then I'm going to be mad. Um, I'm still trying to catch up on my shows. I haven't finished watching anything from Wednesday has not gotten done as far as watching and I have my normal checking emails and things of that sort but I wanted to unbox this number one because the lighting is still lighting and then again I've been wanting to know what I had because just I picked the first I picked three items but I always forget what I picked yeah um in hopes I think this evening I am going because we were supposed to try that I haven't found anybody to give this to this might go into somebody I don't know if we do secret sandals or somebody somebody get I might give this to my sister because she's coming. That's who won't get it. Anyways. Um, so I, I hopefully I'm gonna go ahead and try this tonight. Hopefully because I need to sleep good. I slept good last night, but you know when you haven't been getting rest that you have to uh take you a while to to recoup and I'm rambling because clearly I'm just talking to each other. Y'all like this y'all like that? It's set in the mood, ain't it? I like that, I like that. Anyway, bye y'all, because I got things to do. Alright, here you guys. So Got my Ipsy in today. Now, I did just come from Bath and Body Works. Um, as of the date that we are speaking, they had car scents on sale. Bath and Body Works only does that like one time a year. Obviously, I didn't bring them in because I went on to put them in the car. Um, but if I remember when I'm in the car one day, then I'll show you what I got. I also had a free reward, and I got a new um, thingy in there. So that's real, real cute. So, oh, Ipsy comes in with the clutch with the little with the little paper. Um, I should do the unboxing as I normally do, but my bed not made this today, so we're not even worried with it. So we're just gonna go ahead and jump in. So first thing we have is the Pathology Hydrate and Hydrate Thirst Quenching Sheet Mask that you wear for five minutes. So that's really cute. I'm really thinking about 
doing a self-care type number and using these together. That'll be really cute. So that might be something we do coming up because y'all know I'm preparing for um, things. So really loving this um, pouch. It's like that velvety. I love the pink. I love the gold. Like this one is really, really cute. Alright, so the first thing we got is the Jekka Block Hydrating Primer. Okay. And then we have a Tarte Mascara. One thing for sure, I'm always going to get a bunch of mascara. Hold on, I'm going too quick. So, going back to the Pathology Hydrating Sheet Mask. So, um, we'll talk about that when I'm doing it. So, pretty much that retails for $10. Um... And then we have the um, Jekka Block Hydrating Primer. And the full size of that retails for $20. And then we have the Tarte Tartelette Tubing Mascara. And the full size of that is $25. Like I said, one thing's for sure, it's going to make sure I got the mascara, honey. Then we have the Marme Trans Exam Acid Glutathione Eye Cream. So yeah, um, hope you don't hear my husband fussing in the back. I hope that's not what's in the background. Uh, full size of that is 24. And then last but not least, we have a V Cosmetic Spotlight Strobing Powder and Illuminating in Montreal. So it's giving, but it's a highlighter, probably. Let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. So this is what it's looking like. Uh oh. Oop. Okay. So I don't know. It says illuminating. I mean, I don't know. What would it do if we uh, I tried that. Um, but okay. So those are the three um uh, four things we got. Honestly, we got some skincare. I'm not really too excited about these items <laughs> right now. I'm like, eh, cool, whatever. Um but that's that. So we'll see. I'm more excited about the bag than anything, child. Sure is. So I'm definitely going to get into trying some of these things. I want to do when you try. We'll try all of them together. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. So that's all I got. So I'm um, not going to hold y'all too long because that's, that's all we had. Yeah, that's all we had. So, um... Nothing really spectacular going on this evening. Um, yeah, I did go and work out on my lunch break. I, I love that for me. Um, this is like my second time working out in November. Um, I really have been off my game, but I'm really thankful to be back in there. Um, so I'm about to do my daily things, and honestly, we probably won't check back in because I'm not too much is happening right now. I'm really just trying to get ready to plan out content for Vlogmas. Because um, I'm getting a little nervous because I don't think I'm going to have um, as many videos already batched, recorded already like I would like. And that's probably me overthinking or whatever. Because honestly, technically, technically, this video, we like how I'm doing the weekly vlogs, I'll probably be just fine. Because really, I just only need to put out two more. And then that following week, the I cannot put one out. I mean, honestly, my videos don't come out to about what, Thursday or Friday anyway. So, technically, that last week would be when Vlogmas would start. So, technically, um, aside from adding things to this vlog, I can really start recording now for Vlogmas. And I think that's what I'm about to do. So, probably, like I said, I need to try this. And then we got the hydrating mask. So, I may do some sort of um, holiday self-care type situation. Um, we'll see. We'll make it do what it do. I always get a little nervous. My anxiety gets a little like, eh. As we get close to vlogmas because 25 videos every day is a lot and it's really stressful um and i'm just trying to set myself up for best case scenario so yeah so i'm going to go ahead and plan some content out and probably get ready to get my video um my clips ready for when i edit this week um for last week's vlog and yeah i'm rambling because I'm overthinking. But yeah, hope you guys are having a good day. We'll chat most likely tomorrow because like I said, I don't have anything 
spectacular going on, so we probably won't talk till tomorrow. And I'm really trying to figure out what we're going to talk about tomorrow, to be completely honest. So we'll check back in when we check back in. <laughs> okay, guys. So <clears throat> today is the undergraduate probate. So y'all remember this coat that they got me for our anniversary? So I'm going to pair it with these mustard pants. This blue tank top, I'm going to wear this necklace and some pearls. Don't really want to wear these, but we move. Um, I retwisted my hair. I need to fuzz it out, and then I need to do my makeup. The plan is for me to do a um, halo eye. I believe I should have time for that. Um, it's time for me to go back to work. I set a timer for me to get my clothes out. Um, so I'm going to start getting ready about 2.30, so I'm glad that I got my clothes out, I think on my next break I'm going to iron my clothes, and then get the, um, the question is, how do I know how much time I got left, because I'll be talking, is that 33 minutes, okay, that's cool, um, I'm trying to be cognitive of the time I got, because I tried to edit a video last night, baby, I edited it and thought it was uploading, and it was not. Hey, that for me. Um, but which is fine because I'm more than likely to just get clips of the parade on my phone, and I was going to do the parade on my phone, so I'm just going to need to edit two videos on Sunday. But anyway, let me go back to work. Hey, you guys. So my outfit's all complete. I'm all dressed. I did get to do that makeup look I wanted to do. This is the outfit thus far. I haven't put my shoes on, but I am going to pair this outfit with these shoes. Um, I'm going, I'm on track to leave, um, on time, so I plan to get a full body picture on campus. Um, I mix the fire flow, fire lanes, as y'all can see, that's my favorite lotion, obviously, and I paired it with the magic in the air, so that's my scent for the evening. Um, it is, the so time is now 3.32, I'm changing over my purse, I'm going to wear my, um, all of these are d different color blues, but I'm going to pair I'm bringing my Michael Kors uh, blue bag. Um, I do have my little thing for me to take pictures. I'm making sure to grab all my cards. I'm hoping to be able to get a good spot and not have to park in the parking deck, but we will see. Um, and this lighting is definitely not giving my makeup what it's supposed to give. So I'm definitely going to take some pictures. My hair is giving. Um, so, yeah. Um, we will. I won't come back and talk to you guys anymore, probably. Because by the time I get back here, I need to go to bed because we're going to the Christmas parade in the morning. So this will conclude the the clip. You'll get clips from the probate. And this will officially conclude the vlog. So this will be the last vlog of November. And so when I will see you guys again, um, after this vlog, it will be Vlogmas. Stay tuned. See you guys later. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in Vlogmas.